Hi children, welcome to today's story time and today I'm going to be reading There's a Dragon in Your Book and this is by Tom Fletcher. I'm going to need your help in this story. Oh look, there's an egg in your book. It looks ready to hatch. Whatever you do, don't turn the page. What should I do? Shall I turn the page? I can't believe you did that. The egg has hatched and now there's a dragon in your book. Don't be scared. It's a baby dragon. Why don't you tickle her little nose? Can you stretch out your fingers and tickle her nose? Give her a tickle. We made her sneeze. There she is. She's very cute, isn't she? Oops. The dragon accidentally sneezed a fire in your book. We need to put it out quickly. Help dragon blow out the flame and turn the page. Children, quickly blow on the flame. Quickly, quickly. Uh-oh. Oh no. Your dragon didn't blow the fire out. She blew even more fire. Carefully cover the flames by turning the page. That should put them out. Can you help me to turn the page? Oh, let's hope it puts them out. <gasps> That's no good. The fire is getting bigger. Don't get too close. If only we could think of a way to put out this fire. <gasps> what could we do? Can you think of a way? That's it. Let's use your imagination to put the fire out. Imagine a great big water balloon right in the middle of the next page. Make sure it's full and ready to pop. Okay, children, close your eyes. Imagine a water balloon. Fill it right up. Is it ready to pop? Shall we see if you did it? Oh, you did! Perfect. Now use your finger to pop the balloon and get ready for the... Are you ready to pop it? I'll bring it closer. Pop! Splash! Look what you did. You popped it. Hooray! You put the fire out. Give the dragon a high five. Give her a high five. You have a great imagination. And Dragon must be a little hungry now. Why don't you use your imagine again and think up a yummy treat for her? How about a great big cone filled with a triple scoop of yummy, ice cold chocolate and strawberry flavoured ice cream with sprinkles. Wow, that looks delicious. Did you imagine that delicious ice cream? Looks good, doesn't it? She looks very happy in there. You think you'd like to dive into a giant ice cream? Yum! Well, Dragon must be tired after all that adventure. I think it's time for her to fly home. Can you see she looks very full in her tummy, doesn't she? I think I'd be full if I ate that much ice cream. She looks very full. She's going to need some help taking off. Flap the book up and down like giant dragon wings. Can you flap for me, children? Flap those arms up and down. Okay, nearly there. Keep flapping. Keep flapping. There she goes. Goodbye, dragon. Wave goodbye and turn the... Oh, hang on a second. What's this? More eggs. Whatever you do, don't turn the page. Should I stop there? Would you like me to turn the page and you can have a see? Shall I? Okay, are you ready? Uh oh, I think it's time to close the book carefully. 
Can you see them all there? I think there's going to be lots of mischief coming to you. If you had a little dragon in your book at home, what mischief would your little dragon get up to? And what would you imagine to feed it when it was hungry? I hope you enjoyed that story, children. Bye for now.